favorite athletes is Coach Hud. Um, we are going into the final third of this strength cycle, um, and uh, we're going to have some a few changes um, in the after class strength and conditioning portion. So I just want to mention what's what's uh, what's going on. So we are also in our um, this will be our fifth and final week of the open. So um, this week we will have the same. Um, workout schedule that you guys have seen the last uh, four weeks with the Open with Fridays being um, an all strength day and then Saturday being the Open workout. The following week we will go back to our normal schedule of um, having a mix of practice workouts, competition workouts, and mental toughness workouts throughout the week and our normal Saturday 8 a.m. and 9, uh, 9 a.m. classes. The after class and strength conditioning portion for the last four weeks of this um, uh, session will be on Monday, we'll have a, um, a two inch deficit deadlift. So the pads that we, um, we, we use typically for the Atlas stones, you would stand on top of a couple of those to create like a two inch deficit and do deadlifts from there. Um, we will do uh, hammer curls on Monday, uh, dumbbell hammer curls, um, and then Mondays will be a midline uh, static uh, mid core work. Tuesday is going to be pin presses. Uh, the coaches can show you uh, about the uh, the pin press. What that's going to be is you're going to do a press um, from usually from the rig at a elevated um, position than your normal um, press from. Uh, where it would rest on your shoulders or just into your hands right above your shoulders. So the press is going to start somewhere around like mid of your face, eyes, forehead, wherever you kind of have your sticking spot and then you work through the press um, through that position. Um, we'll have skill work and there will be um, some aerobic capacity on Tuesdays as well. Um, Wednesdays we'll have two count pulse squats, so a two count hold at the bottom. We will do uh, tricep kickbacks uh, for the bodybuilding portion, and then we'll have some dynamic um, midline work. Um, Thursdays will still be our strongman. Um, Fridays will um, uh, have uh, this. Cur this current Friday will only have a small amount of, of either skill work or a static um, uh, midline work. And then starting the um, after this after this open is done, the Fridays will have a, a close grip bench press in for the uh, after class strength and conditioning portion. Um, we just finished up a deload week for our strength portions, so you'll see starting this week that the volume will start to pick up again. We'll have uh, volume. We'll continue that volume through the twelve to through, through the end of the twelve weeks. We'll take it, which will take us through the uh, end of November. We will have a two-week taper in uh, December, and then we will go into testing week, and then we'll be right there before the holiday season where um, where Rare will be releasing their um, holiday schedule. Um, and during that time frame, we're going to do some, uh, we'll have some fun workouts. We'll do some of our longer wads. We'll take a break from the strength portion for those, uh, for those holiday weeks, unless you'd like to work on it after class. And, um, and then we'll kick off the new year in another cycle. Um, I think that's it. it. covers all the changes that are coming up. If you guys got any questions, just ask them in this Facebook post um, or grab one of the coaches and they'll be willing to help you out. Uh, that, I believe that's it for this week. So I will see you guys in the box. And this is me wishing you both love, peace, and fitness. We'll see you later, guys.